All right, so we got our low water cutoff here. Um, we're going to be working with a McDonald and Miller guard dog. Okay, and I have the BX ready to go. This is my power coming in for my transformer. I have a, another one ready to go, and this will be coming out of our low water cutoff and going straight to our boiler. So before I connect those, I just want to show you guys some of the wires here. You have a black and a white, and this is the power we're going to use to power the circuitry in the low water cutoff. Um, I have my ground wire connected here already, and we have these two yellow wires. These yellow wires is where the circuit actually gets broken in a low water situation. All right, so now we have our BX wires hooked up. We got our power coming in from our transformer. We got our power going out to our boiler. We have our black and white wires from the guard dog that powers the circuitry inside. We have our ground to the guard dog box, and we have our yellow wires, which breaks the circuit in a low water situation. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start off the same way I did the others, and I'm gonna get the grounds out of the way and connect those first. Okay, so now we have all our grounds connected, and I have that out of the way. I'm gonna take all my neutrals, and I'm gonna connect all those together. So now we have a ground wires connected, we have our neutral wires connected, and what we have left is the black wire coming from your transformer, the 120 volts. We have our black wire that powers the control board in the cutoff, and we have our black wire going out to our boiler. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our black wire and we're gonna connect it to the other black wire that powers our circuitry, and then we're gonna connect the yellow wire uh, as part of the cutoff circuit. So basically what we're doing here is we're bringing our power in, we're powering the board, and we're sending power to this, this one side of the circuit that's going to be broken in a low water cutoff situation. The power only has one place to go now, and it's on the other yellow wire. And we're going to connect that up to our black wire going out to our boiler. So what we're doing is basically we're separating our black wires from the power coming in and the power going out through these yellow wires. So in this situation, in a low water uh, circumstance, everything's going to shut down. Nothing's going to have power past this point.